What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Ecola Espresso and welcome to another Advanced Warfare video here today and what we're going to be talking about today is the Gorge Bonus Multiplayer Map in Advanced Warfare. Now, I know I covered the Collector's Editions a few days ago, but to be fair, I didn't give like any love at all to the reimagination of Pipeline. So this video here today, we're going to be discussing a little bit about this collector's edition bonus before i get too far to my extreme surprise yesterday and extreme delight you guys killed yesterday's video for the first time on my channel a ghost video crossed 100 likes and even weirder still in terms of ratings it outperformed the last two advanced warfare videos here that i did so for this one let's aim for 80 likes on this slowly inching it higher and higher but that's because i know we can do it so but enough about ratings let's talk about gorge gorge is part of the collector's editions both the atlas pro and limited editions of the game it's listed also on the digital pro edition on the call of duty website but some of the links don't really work like the xbox one it takes you to a page that says it's not available and then for the xbox 360 and pc users it says it isn't available to begin with but anyways for the time being it's only a part of the collector's additions an interesting little spin on things considering each call of duty for the past few years has had some sort of map available for pre-ordering only no collector's additions needed this one and switching it up a little bit so i'm guessing that we're going to be getting it released to the general public in march or so or perhaps even earlier from that or who knows even maybe it will be added to those who pre-ordered it in the next couple weeks here so some basic info it's the reimagination of pipeline from cod 4 as much as i love that map i'm not entirely sure that would have been my first choice to remake it so we'll get to why i believe it actually is a prime choice though for advanced warfare in just a few but other than the reimagination as per the official description of the map atlas corporation has commandeered the world's largest power source the three gorges dam in central china whose sinister backdrop creates a gripping setting for multiplayer battle combatants will navigate the shadows, explore the map's new verticality empowered by exoskeleton technology, and control a map-based turret score streak that overlooks the dam and helps keep enemies at bay. So right there, that sounds pretty damn cool, all puns intended there. My guess is that the hillside where the trees were in pipeline will be the edge of the dam, where it will even out and level off at lower ground. Perhaps the turret will be atop the hillside there at the upper edge of the dam. That theory is based off the logo for the map, but we don't know exactly. But for me, it's a good guess and starting point. Now, like I was saying, before pipeline not really my first pick in terms of remakes and i feel a lot of people could probably say the same thing there there is one giant reason though that sticks out to me in terms of why it would be remade for advanced warfare sledgehammer wants to boast the new abilities in game of the exosuits and what better way to do it than remaking one of the tallest maps in call of duty history while pipeline only had three tiers of play the scaffolding the ground and the very short underground tunnels the scenic backdrop of abandoned factory and how unbelievably tall the buildings were in comparison to what was actually playable this is a perfect way to showcase boost jumps and vertical play so I can guarantee you that you'll be able to get to places you wished you could when you were playing pipeline back then with the exosuit ability so it's going to add so much more to the flow and lines of sight and everything about the way the map will play but even though it's a remake of the map I guarantee the flow is going to be completely different so hopefully in a good way along with the verticality I also feel like the map will be genuinely good for all types of players and that's another reason why I think it was remade is it's not just good for snipers run gunners or campers everyone could thrive on that map it was just open enough and just enough cover to suit all sorts of play styles looking at it in hindsight now that all the buzz has kind of died down from it i'm really glad that this map was chosen to be remade so that's all for today's video guys let me know what you guys think down in the comment section down below do you think pipeline was a good choice for a remake why or why not thank you guys for watching if you did like the video please leave a like ring down below any shares to your facebook twitter and or my specific if you like that always greatly appreciate it if you're new here be sure to subscribe for the best of color the events warfare content any new news and information you guys know exactly to find out right here up on my channel thank you guys once again so much for watching my name is Nicola espresso as always if you guys are having a great day i should see you guys tomorrow take care and peace Surprise,